Hi, and welcome back to the first behind the scenes look of 2021. This video covers our first campaign with the amazing team of Creative Office. This campaign included a complete strategy for photo and for video, covering studio and lifestyle photography, social media content, and a more classic set of fashion videos. To really push the team, we set out to create all of this content in just one day. <laughs> this meant we had to shoot all content super efficient. To shoot as efficient as possible, we used the red Komodo on the Crane 2 as gimbal, the red Raven for handheld shots and the black magic in a 9x16 setup for social media content. We divided this video content in three categories. The first is the lifestyle content. To promote the story and the lifestyle of Revieux, we created a video that focuses on the brand and their story. We shot this mostly handheld to separate the video from the other main video, the lookbook video. <laughs> In this lookbook video, we focused more on the clothing. So less story and more selling based content. You know, the smooth movement lets you focus more on the clothing itself. And the last part of our main video strategy was social media. We wanted to create three social media videos, but due to the immense time pressure, we only ended up doing one. We shot everything of that video strategy in the vertical position so it would be better fitted for you know most social media platforms. So like always big shout out to the team that made this happen. Luc van Zuyle, our producer, thank you for keeping us in line. <laughs> Selena Coppa, our makeup artist, you did an awesome job on makeup, styling and bringing that positive vibe on set. Eviane, uh, I mentioned before, our photographer, always a pleasure to work with you and to learn from you. Sanna, thank you for helping out on set and, you know, speeding up things a lot. All videos were scripted, so when editing these videos, we used the script to quickly create our first edits. Uh, we, with the use of slow motion and the overall pace between edits, we were able to create three unique videos before I even got to the grading part of the content. <laughs> um, and so to match the pace and style of the video, uh, I chose three songs that all have a classical feeling, but uh, still are very different. Uh, in the color grading suite, I created one look for both red cameras and I used the, that color palette for both the lookbook and the lifestyle video, as we really liked um, the look overall. Uh, on a shoot like this, you learn a lot about time efficiency and overall workflow. Next time, I will not use three cameras. I thought it would work, but at the end, it was so much switching between the red setup and the black magic setup that it took more time that it, than that it gave us. I think having just two cameras for all the content will be better. Um, also, <laughs> I lost a ton of time trying to use a single location for both the lifestyle and the lookbook video. I really wanted to create two completely different videos, but, uh, but in the end, uh, a lot of uh, you know shots look the same. Um, so making better use of uh, the location would have set these videos apart even more. At the end, we created a full fall winter campaign with only one day of shooting. And you know, I hope you liked this behind the scenes impression of this shoot. Let me know what you want to know about shooting fashion content in the comment section down below so we can focus more on those particular parts next time. You know, 
consider subscribing for more content in the future and hopefully see you soon in the next video. Later.